Hey Dreamers, this is Jade and I'm excited because I have a new Chic Sparrow unboxing to share with you guys. They finally, finally made a pocket size folio in a collaboration with Sam Kelly from Sam Plans. I will link her below if you're not familiar with her channel. Um, and as soon as it dropped, I was itching to get my hands on this because I've been wanting a pocket folio from Chic Sparrow for quite a long time now so let's get into this i'm gonna open this up and be right back okay so we're all open up so let's get into this i'm so excited okay let's get this out of the way and i got several notebooks out so we could fit them in here anyway here is the traditional packaging as you see how it's wrapped and then you just slide this on out here and this is the warranty card that it comes with and my order notes, I'm going to slip those out. All right. And here we go. See, they put this in one of the bigger bags. They usually have a smaller bag for the pockets and stuff. But you guys, look how beautiful. Oh, my God. That is so lovely. Look at this pocket. Look at the just the variation in colors on this. Okay, here's the front. Look, has a little bit of a sheen to it. And here is the inside. So pretty. Now, I wonder, oh, that's for the pocket. Okay, I'm like, what is this? Okay, I don't care, but this was curious. Anyway, here's the inside. And of course, and then here is what the back looks like. So I'm going to stick my finger in here because I know they say they use glue. So you have to kind of loosen up the inside corners and stuff to get stuff to fit. Now, this was made for the moleskin, specifically to fit the moleskin daily um, journal, which is a thicker moleskin. Um, I don't, I generally don't use moleskin. So we're going to try different sizes of stuff in this and see what exactly fits. So I do have one here, a smaller moleskin. It's not the daily one. Um, and this is my affirmation journal. Ironically, um, in my last quarter update that I shared with you guys, I said that I had stopped using this and either the day of the, or the day after I had picked it up again. So there you go. So we're going to see if I can slip this in here and this thing is getting in the way so let me try the other side let's do the other side yes and see how that that slips in there quite nicely there we go Oh, pretty. I love this so much. Let's get that out of the pocket. Yes. Okay. I have different ones to try. I may end up ordering another one because I love this so much. All right. Let's pop that out. Okay. I wanted to try to see if my Loish term fits in here. I'm not sure if it would as far as like the front and back covers. But we are going to try and see if it will slip in here without, and it doesn't look like, it doesn't look like the Loish, the Loish term is going to fit. So, I may consider eventually switching to a moleskin uh, for doing this, but we'll see. Anyway, I do have an Exceed journal I have not opened, in case anyone is wondering about that, because moleskin is not... Um, exactly completely economical um, and these exceed notebooks are um, of really great quality actually and they are on the cheaper side so let's pop this open as well okay we have the exceed notebook open now so let's see I'm pretty sure this is gonna fit because it's pretty much the same size as this moleskin and I will show you by comparison like with well it's a little wider it looks like however um height wise looks the same i should say a little thicker not wider because the width and height is about the same but it has more pages it looks like 
So let's pop this in and see what we're working with. I wanna see if I can get this in the back because that's how I like to put my folios in. It's just that. It's the, what do you call this thing? Little string that's in the way. Might have to end up cutting off strings if I wanna use it that way. But it's going in. Yeah, let's not. It's aggravating <laughs> that way. So I'm gonna try this again on the other side. And it slips right in. So yeah, it's about the same size. It's just like I said, a thicker notebook than this small skin or ones like it. Um, and you can of course get the soft covers. I personally am a hardcover lover. I prefer hardcover notebooks. Not that I don't ever use soft cover, but my preference is um, hardcover. Speaking of soft cover, also I'm going to be transitioning this. Um, this is my pocket Morgan, but it is a travel actual traveler's notebook. Now I've been keeping my daily journal in this that I cut down the size. It is a Hobonichi A6 notebook but i just cut it down to pocket size because um my daily journaling i was using bigger notebooks and it was not working for me and i needed to pivot and so i did that and so i've just been having this hooked onto the last two strings of this morgan because this morgan needed to be used because it's so beautiful um so i want to transition this into here and it should work because it is a pocket so let's see how this yep slips right on in there right on in there i love it i love it and um in case uh you know you're one of those people who like to have both sides in because we have different people some people like one side some people like to do both i will slip this in both ends so you can see how that looks um so yeah but yeah see oh god you guys don't even understand how excited i am about this this collaboration i definitely will probably end up buying another one um something's going on with the chic sparrow website i will say um when i ordered this okay this wasn't supposed to drop until june 25th at 10 a.m pst i think it is um but I was like, I'm going to go ahead and get my iPad set up. So when the time is, I'm Eastern, so I had to, you know, figure out the time or whatever. So when the time is to come, I can go ahead and order it. And like, I won't miss out on it just because I know how things can get snatched up at Chic Sparrow so quickly. So I logged it. It was like way early in the morning um, on June 25th, like maybe two or three o'clock in the morning. Logged into Chic Sparrow and just looked up the kelly i was like i'll go ahead and have it on the page you guys why was i able to go ahead and order it and it was cheaper as well um when i ordered it it was listed for 95 bucks and they had two options which i thought that um jennifer said there was going to be this option which accommodates the bigger moleskin the daily and then one for the weekly now the this one i'm sorry the one that accommodates the daily was available for me to buy and it was um i think it was listed for 95 dollars, and i had a coupon and everything or coupon code and then um the other one which was the one for the weekly which would have been a smaller version that doesn't it wasn't supposed to have the pocket i was going to get both but that one was not available to buy. So I said, maybe that's what they're waiting for June 25th for. Anyway, so I went ahead and bought this at a cheaper price. And I'm glad I did. Um, because I didn't have to have that whole anxious feeling of, am I going to be able to get one and blah, blah, blah. And then the next day when I went to look again to see if I could get the smaller one, that one wasn't even listed or available. And this one had went up to 105 bucks. So, um, yeah, I, I don't know how I managed to get in on the sneak tip on that one, but I'm glad I went ahead and checked it out early to get myself set up and in good position to buy one because I ended up getting it cheaper. And, um, yeah, so I'm probably going to end up buying another one of these because um, I really, really, really love this so much. Um, and like I said, something's going on with their shipping. Um, 
I even asked about it because I was looking at other options. It looks like they're offering pockets in other leathers. Leathers that I have because I was gonna I was thinking of getting a Morgan or a Waypoint, which I've gotten the A6 folios in. But when you go to the shipping, it's the, the lowest one you can um get is like fifteen dollars and change. And I'm like, now I know I only paid for the economy shipping for these other ones, every other one that I've had, and it's either been between like three three dollars and like five dollars um that's the most i've paid for shipping from chic sparrow but um everything that i wanted to get was coming up like 15 bucks except for this this was five dollar shipping so i'm confused and it's still five dollar shipping so i sent an email and the lady responded saying that some things weigh more and that's why um you can't get the um cheaper shipping however I'm just going to go ahead and put that out. That doesn't make any sense to me simply because I was looking at pocket, um, pocket size things of leathers that I already have. Um, I already have this A6, I have the Morgan folio in A6 and I have the Waypoint folio in A6 size. Pocket is smaller. Both of those, I was able to get the $5 economy shipping. And now for the pocket size, it's 15 bucks makes absolutely no sense so i'm hoping they figure something out or like maybe enough people complain and they get the the shipping back into some kind of order because 15 dollars for shipping in the united states is a bit much um so yeah and it's like you can only pick priority i'm like just give me economy first class media mail whatever like i i just shipping 15 dollars for shipping is just it's just astronomical anyway I'm going to unrant here, but yeah, I probably will be picking up another one of these because it is so pretty. The leather is so gorgeous. So, um, and as I said, this is a collaboration between Sam Kelly and Chic Sparrow. I will link Sam Kelly below. You can check her out. And I hope this has been helpful to anybody considering purchasing this. Um, already, I feel like it is was definitely worth worth it. So. That is it. Um, hope everyone has been safe and well, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye.